here. Today is December 23rd and this is the Mindful Minute by Vicki and the reading is from each day a new beginning. December 23rd, the present enshrines the past. Simon de Bouvet. Each of our lives is a multitude of interconnecting pieces, not unlike a mosaic. What has gone before, what will come today, are at once and always entwined. The past has done its part, never to be erased. The present is always a composite. In months and years gone by, perhaps we anticipate the days with dread, fearing the worst. Often we found it. We generally find that which we fear. But we can influence the mosaic our experiences create. The contribution today makes to our mosaic can lighten its shade, can heighten its contrast, can make bold its design. What faces us today? A job we enjoy or one we fear? Growing pains of our children? Loneliness. How we move through the minutes, the hours, influences our perception of future minutes and hours. No moment is involatile. Every moment is part of the whole that we are creating. We are artists. We create our present from influences of our past. I will go forth today. I will anticipate goodness. I will create the kind of moments that will add beauty to my mosaic. And we, we really do have so much control over things happening in our life if we just make that push to look at things from a different lens. And sometimes that's very easy to do and sometimes it's even more challenging. And sometimes there is, there is a um, valid reason for fear, but what I found is as soon as I can let go of that and just trust and, and have a better attitude and have, a, have an attitude of I'm gonna learn something from this, or what am I learning from this is the better question. What am I learning? Why why is this happening? What you know, what ha, what am I doing? What what's what is this all about? And I really do think that every moment is part of the whole that we are creating. We are artists. And I think when we stay in a place where we think positively or we behave positively or we surround ourselves with good uh, that is infectious and it like kind of expounds on each other and I think when we when we're in negative states it's the same kind of thing I, I you know I listen to a lot of different manifestation type uh, I don't know, theories or talks or whatever and and I talked to one person one of my teachers and she said that the universe always agrees with you. So if you are saying, looking at things in a positive way, the universe is going to agree. And if you are looking at things in a negative way, the universe is going to agree. So the universe is always saying yes. So it's up to us to drive our, our thinking away, to steer away from, from the thoughts that are bringing us down and stay in the lane of what's good for us and what's what's um what's positive i guess and and that's what i'm going to try and do today and i hope you all have a wonderful holiday this is the last night uh before christmas eve i hope everyone's had a having a good hanukkah happy hanukkah and just have a beautiful day be well be kind namaste